Pay attention. This man is a cleaner at MIT. He saw a maths problem on the blackboard. Jack thought it was interesting, and he wrote the answer down. Next day, uh -huh. the whole school was a sensation because it was written by the professor to inspire the students. Even he won the math award to work out this problem. It also uh -huh. took two months. Who is so smart? Just got the answer in one day. The professor was curious. So, he wrote down a more difficult math problem on blackboard. This question took him almost two years to figure it out. So, how long it will take Jack this time? because the problem is more difficult. Jack has been doing it a little long. Before he knew it, class was over. The professor came out and looked. There's a cleaner messing around. Suddenly, he's not happy. Go over there and stop him. Jack listened. He's not happy about it. Scold the man and walk away. He lost the professor in one turn. Then the teaching assistant called him. The professor looked back. Oh, my God. The answer is absolutely right. He couldn't believe his eyes. Back to the classroom. The professor began to look for Jack. He thought some student was pretending to be a cleaner, joking with him, but none of the students dared to come forward and admit it. At this moment, Jack is fighting others, but unfortunately, he was arrested on the spot by the FBI. In court, Jack defended himself with the Constitution of the United States that he has only read once and shut the lawyer down, but the judge insisted on finding Jack guilty because this isn't the first time he's had a fight with others. Every week a judge sees him here, but every time he leaned on his mouth to got away with the law, the judge must keep him in mind this time. By this time, the professor had gone through the school administration, got a Jack's business card. He sat in the courtroom, looking at Jack defense Heimzel. He immediately began to cherish the heart of talent, decided to bail out Jack. But there are conditions. First, he had to follow the professor to do his math research. Second, he must receive psychological treatment. But he never thought of it. Jack refused him. Pay attention. Jack is just an ordinary cleaner. He's just when he's cleaning. He did a math problem. And the professor caught him. Learn math and look at psychology. Jack is freaking out. Jack's trying to get out of jail. He still agreed to the professor's conditions. They are studying in mathematics together, and they had a very good time. But when Jack's the shrink's turn, there's something wrong with that. Jack is very defensive. The professor hired five psychiatrists in a row. They all were chased away by Jack in various ways. Because every time he had a psychology class, Jack will be ready in advance. The shrink's book, the perfect way to avoid the shrink's questions. And in the end these doctors, they often break down by Jack when the professor saw but it was no good, so he used another way. He goes to the next school. He was invited his old classmate to help Jack. This man looked normally, but he got a lot of skills. The first day they met, and they started fighting. What's going on? It turns out that Jack is knows a bit of an artist. He saw a picture in the man's office, and Jack got conclusion when he saw it. It was the man's wife cheated him. The man got angry when he heard it. Come in and grab Jack by the neck. Watch out your mouth. Jack smiled. He thought the old man was funny. So the next meeting was arranged. By the lake, the old man apologized to Jack, said he shouldn't have been so impulsive last time. Jack is just a child. He doesn't know what I'm talking about. Maybe he's read a lot of books, but Jack is a complete idiot in love. On him, the old man only saw a hockey boy who's scared of society. He's been hurt. His defense is heavy, but no one knows what happened to him, unless Jack says it himself. With all these words, the old man is turning away, but Jack seemed unmoved. Eat, drink normally, and he falls in love with a girl. That's the girl he met in the bar, a highly qualified student. Jack likes her very much. She was almost perfect in his eyes, but after they finished the first time, they had a fight because his girlfriend wanted Jack to go with him to California, but Jack was reluctant because get out of here. He's no longer a math prodigy. He will be a nameless cleaner. He was afraid that his girlfriend would desert him, so Jack took the lead in breaking up. In psychology class, Jack wanted to find solace from this old man, but he hasn't said a word yet. Yet, the old man invited him out because he can detect there's a lot of negativity inside of Jack. At this time let him stays alone is the best option. He turned around and went to the professor. Burned his math homework because the professor is no longer able to keep pace with Jack. Every time he got Jack's answer, he's been working on it for a long time. This time, Jack has defeated his psychological defense. If he doesn't know Jack, the professor may have a good sleep and a good dream. But when Jack showed up in his life, he was worried about him. He can't sleep every night. In order not to waste Jack's talent, the professor found a job for Jack at the NSA. When Jack at the interview, Jack put the entire NSA system and remember all the plan of capture. The examiner thought him to be a genius. But what about that? Jack is not interested in any of this. All he wanted was to move the bricks. Doing all that dirty, 
tiring work. In lunch break, his friend told Jack, if you're still here in 20 years, I will punch you. You have the gift that we don't have, but you working on a construction site. It was an insult to me. If I wake up tomorrow, I'm 50 years old and still working here. That's no problem because I don't have other skills, but you're holding the million dollar lottery ticket. You don't dare to cash in, but this is what I would have wanted at all costs. Every day I pick you up at your house. We're going to have a drink together. And that's great, but you know what the best part is? I'm the one who knocked on your door. You didn't open the door, didn't say goodbye, and just walked away. Though I read little, but I know you shouldn't. His friends don't want his best friends of geniuses. Just like that, on the construction site, Jackie's inner defense line has loosened. He went back to old man's office. At this moment, the man was looking through Jack's files. It turns out Jack was a little boy, often abused at home. That's what led to the present character. Face this boy. The old man was repeating a sentence over and over. It's not your fault. At this moment, Jack finally let go of his mind. And they are cuddling together. They reached a consensus. Jack is willing to be treated by him. And heeded the advice of the professor. Add to the world of mathematics. That's Jack's birthday. His friend gave him a car. Even though it's ugly. But this is what they've been doing for two years in a junkyard. And then taught himself to assemble day and night. And finally got the car. Jack loved it. He was driving this car. Put a letter in old man's mailbox. It says, tell the professor I'm sorry. Today, I don't care what I want. Just looking for her. He's going to California. Go find the girl. At this time, his friend came to look for him. He find out Jack was gone. He felt so lost. But then he turned his head and smiled, just like they agreed. He was pleased with Jack's choice, because he found his way for life.